Evaluate using L'Hopital's rule. Recognize that we have an indeterminate power. So what we want to do is make a substitution. We're going to let L equal the original limit And from here, we want to take the natural log of both sides. So we have the natural log of L equals the natural log of the limit. From here, we can push the natural log inside of the limit because we know it's a continuous function. So the limit as x approaches infinity of the natural log of e to the x plus 10x raised to the 1 over x. Now we can use log properties to bring down your exponent limit as x approaches infinity, 1 over x times the natural log of e to the x plus 10x. At this point, we can think of that natural log as being in the numerator and x in the denominator. We now have an indeterminate form, which means we can use L'Hopital's rule. So the limit as x approaches infinity of the derivative of the numerator, the natural log, we get 1 over e to the x plus 10x times the derivative of the inside, e to the x plus 10. And then we also need to continue using L'Hopital's rule and take the derivative of the denominator, which is x. The derivative of x is just 1. So let's rewrite this now as a single fraction. We have e to the x plus 10 over e to the x plus 10x. We'll use L'Hopital's rule again. Giving us e to the x over e to the x plus 10. Again, we'll use L'Hopital's rule one more time. Limit as x goes to infinity of e to the x over e to the x, which is the limit as x approaches infinity of 1, which is 1. But keep in mind, this is not the answer that we're looking for. This is the answer to the natural log of our limit. We want the limit itself, just L. We don't want the natural log of L. So keep that in mind. We need to think about that. Natural log of L equals 1. So what we're going to do is we're going to take E to the power of the left and e to the power of the right. Now we can see that L is equal to e. So the original limit as x approaches infinity of e to the x plus 10x to the 1 over x is e.